and welcome to Are You Aware of the Air? And today we are going to be talking about air pollution. I'll be handing you over to Daisy to talk about idling. Hello, as Naya said, I am here to be talking about idling. Also, coming up on the show will be about your health and safety and mist busting. First, we are going to be talking to Dr. Neil. Hi, Neil. What is idling? It is when a car has stopped moving but the engine is still on. This produces air pollution. One type of pollution is nitrogen dioxide pollution caused by the exhaust pipe. What part of the body does air pollution affect the most? It affects the lungs the most because it, it can stop us from breathing and can cause a high chance of dying and lung cancer or asthma. What else does it affect? It also affects your brain, spoils your memory and can be bad for your heart. Thank you for coming to our show. I'll be handing over to B. Jane Ollie. Thank you, Daisy and Naya. I am outside the Swabbage Rough Police Station. We are talking about idling. I'm here with Police Ollie. Is idling illegal? It is illegal because you can get a fine of up to £80. Many people do this, but they don't know the consequences. Where do most people idle? They idle at the train station because there are lots of trains going in and out. And, mo and traffic lights because they, they can take a couple of minutes. Also, a quarter of people idly get caught at schools pick, trying to pick up their children. Do you think it would be a better place without idling? As being a police officer of Sawbridgeworth, it would be a better and safer place on the road. We will now hand you over to Amelia and Poppy, our presenters. Thank you, BJ. Welcome to our myth fasting. Often people misunderstand when and why they need to use their engines. I'm going, for, I'm going to hand over to Poppy and she will tell you more and will help you answer these myths. Someone special is here to help me answer these questions. Welcome AC, our anti-idling campaigner. How many balloons of pollution are formed in one minute from a car? That's a hard question. Just kidding. That's an easy question. The answer to your question is 150 balloons of pollution in one minute from a car. How about you ask two more questions and then Poppy can lead us out. Does it break your car to stop and start the engine? No, it doesn't, but idling can damage your car. That answers my question well. Next is, does pollution affect younger children more than adults? Well it will affect children more because the child is smaller and closer to the exhaust pipes than and a child's lungs are still growing as they're smaller than an average size adult's lungs. Also, an adult is much taller than a child. Thank you, AC. Now back to Naya and Daisy in the studio. We hope that answered all the common questions. Thank you to the studio two presenters. Thank you to all the presenters. We went through what is I doing and what damages our lungs. We also had Dr Neil. Thank you for watching now and I'll see you tomorrow at 7.30am. Bye now.